Hello and welcome back to another episode of uh, Diaries of Death. My name is Aiken and today we're continuing the World of Warcraft uh, Diaries of Death. Death that is that hardcore series where we were playing a Frost Mage. Today is the day where we are playing Zulfarak. Got our buffs running. Got everything nicely set up and we got a tank who is using markings. So much so that I can actually CC we have a rope that zaps. We just have a warlock uh, that doesn't want to use any CC and instead Just wants to uh, get things down. However, the master of CC is here, so we're not going to let uh, CC be discriminated. Damage is important, you can do it, but CC is great as well. And that will be the name of the game for today. We have a bunch of quests. To be precise, 20 troll temper, uncracked scarab shells, uh, a tablet, the D venomatic rod, and uh, end bosses scales. It's going to be fun. People are not fully healed, so that's not. The wisest choice to continue pulling. Yeah, and our warlock man, he's going to get us killed. Well, himself. I will be long out of here if that happens. Got my speed potion. And got plenty of options to get out of here. I would suggest you go for the totem as well. No one wants to just destroy the totem. Holy moly. The warlock is not on the same page as everybody else. That can become dangerous. I'll just make sure that these guys are not running away because that's the number one reason for getting killed. Need to focus the totems and the rope right away after that as well. This group, oh, oh. this group is not looking solid.
Well, our warlock is actively undermining the effort of crowd controlling by emulating uh, the shield target. But okay, whatever. Like I said, it's the arrogance of, uh, of assuming crowd control not necessary warlock has now started to pull which is very very dangerous i'll just let it run and uh, keep back i wouldn't be surprised if this is going to be the first time that we're going to see someone uh, die in any of my dungeon runs I'll just stay with full mana. Now people want to skip. Put ice block out of uh, the hex, but I'll save that whenever it's really needed. Keep in mind the hex dangerous uh, because it'll disable the casting. reckless guys uh, together stay out of uh, them. Alright, I need to drink after that one. People still continue to pull. Let's get this 
All right, these scarabs are going to be our first quest. So there we go. First tablet. Very good, so scarabs uh, mm. are going to uh, drop their stuff, I'm going to come back to them in a second. Oh yeah, nice, these guys are crystallizing petrifying rather I distinctly remember them as long as we're really just pulling one of them at a time this group is actually working very well good damage tank keeps aggro and in here is the first boss corrected with the aggro keeping on the sewer there we go Let's get his totems down. going offline that's not good Time to regain mana. Oh, this 
is a shit show. Eating self buff uh, food, that wasn't good. Given that I need to tank so much, I will go with Major Armor here. No compromises. Uh, very good. Well, we still need more of uh, the shells. And whilst they are getting uh, their stuff ready, I'll just wait here for a second. So unfortunately, I think I'll not make it to five out of five for the scarabs. Yeah, but we'll see. There are still a couple more to come. Let's go.
that was long. I went into the uh, top of the mountain. Okay, both of them are slow, which is good. Like I said, this here is a very special group. A couple of close calls already. People aren't really listening to the tank either. They're not on the same page. Yeah, in that case, all you can do is be careful and be not the one that is getting shot. However, I will also not let anyone die. If I can't help them, I will. how to not do it everybody was just on their own page the warlock happily not watching the surroundings Oh boy. 
Well, it's going to be rough. So what could we have done better? For obvious reasons, the Warlock uh, shouldn't have to F that up. Secondly, fighting in here wasn't the optimal choice. I would have rather fought over here. And then, just very simple. simple. Start clearing stuff and don't uh, just skip it. It's really that simple. All of these here are good experienced mobs. If you chain pull them, there's quite a bit of experience. I mean, it's 100 XP a pop. And we're killing them reasonably fast, so I don't see any issue. As much as I appreciate Shotty for killing that little beetle, uh, there's a time and place. Like, if no one is pulling, uh, when I did it, for instance, yes, you can uh, do that. And even then, without voice communication, it's never optimal to not let the tank pull. But yeah. I'm sitting here and talking essentially to the wall, and the silence agrees with me. Preaching to the choir, like they say. 20 intellect, that's a stunner of a roll. I like it. I think I'll greet for it. the damage by just killing the totem, I know. Completely shocking tactics. <laughs> Reminded to myself, backline dot, Let's not get invited again. I recall correctly there was a bit of a gathering down there Yeah. 
Yep, there we go. City Stone. to re-mana. And to use our heavy dynamite. Granted, that is an encounter pretty much tailored for an age. <laughs> that was a good one. Maybe they changed it, but I remember that essentially these wouldn't uh, fill up again. Apparently I'm wrong. Forward. 
And yeah, that's where the actual next bosses are, uh, are coming from. Yeah, yeah, I remember correctly. Using the pathing of the uh, mobs here. Fantastic. So I think I can still ring through uh, through that. Maybe not. good nice little leather armor not that we need that uh, but good for a druid i suppose so stairs fight done That was a lot of damage and our utilization of uh, the improved blizzard already come uh, came in clutch i love it Very good. Somehow the group, against all odds, is pulling through. I would have not uh, given them uh, the chance to do that. The Warlock slowed down a little bit. Uh, the tank isn't overdoing it with his markings. And luckily we do have a good healer. Of course we're being betrayed.
both of them severely slowed down. Yeah, that's good. That's actually not bad, and for once the warlock decided to not uh, break my crowd control, which is a nice change of pace. Wow, and he even charmed that guy. Unreal. Very good. Now, right hand side, uh, <laughs> there's a massive Hydra uh, that needs some beating, and then the, the end boss is through there. Of course, also change uh, the order, no problemo. can't believe that the warlock will get that that's a pretty gnarly ring That's pretty gnarly ring. Not that he would have deserved it after his performance here, but life is oftentimes not fair. Yeah, we are indeed lucky to still be alive. That is. You have that twice now. <laughs> that is some red equipment, man. Right, slow them down. Very good.
Back to land out this evening in my guild. Oh, man. I don't know what to think about it. The guy knows how to deal DPS, but his perception of how it should work in the dungeon is very, very different to what I would think. It'll likely not be the last time that we did Zulfarak, uh, but hopefully the next time is a little bit more coordinated. This one here was a clown show. Out of our quests, we got one completed. Still need a lot of troll temper. One more scarab shell. And the second. By the way, all of uh, those. Just as an info, guys. Uh, mm. We all need troll sweat for the quest, so there is no harm in just clearing the dungeon. That's another thing, instead of just clearing that whole thing and everybody gets their quests. People are so obsessed uh, with uh, skipping.
Well, it is what it is. That was Sulfurak. A little bit of a freak show this time, but yeah, it is what it is. Uh, I hope you still enjoyed it. We got moderate loot, I think a small upgrade. Uh, the good hands unfortunately went uh, to, to someone else. But yeah, that's um, just how that goes. Thanks all for watching guys, have a good one and see you next time, bye bye.